Ms. Evans, please introduce yourself for the record. My name is Grace Evans, and I want to thank you for letting me speak today. Even though I'm only 11 years old, <clears throat> I know that everyone deserves to have a mom and a dad. If you change the law that says two moms or two dads could get married, it would take away something very important for children like me across the state. My mom is very important to me because she teaches me about things about being a girl. She is kind, thoughtful, gentle, and beautiful. She cares for me and others and listens very well to things I want to talk to her about. I am learning from her to be a good woman, wife, and mother someday. Even though I learned some of these things from my dad, <clears throat> my mom teaches them in a very special way. Without my mom, it would be very hard for me to learn them. She is my role model on how to be a girl, and I love her very much. My, <clears throat> my dad is also very important to me because he protects me and helps me get the confidence to be a girl who is growing up to be a woman. He takes care of problems in a way that my mom cannot. Just like my mom wouldn't be able to be the woman she is without my dad. I wouldn't be able to be the woman I want to be without my dad. Because he is strong, wise, and different than my mom, I learn things from him that I would not be able to learn in the same way from my mom. Since every child needs a mom and a dad to be born, I don't think we can change that children need a mom and a dad. I believe God made it that way. I know some disagree, but I want to ask you this question. Which parent do I not need, my mom or my dad? I'll ask again, which parent do I not need, my mom or my dad? <clears throat> I hope that you can see that every child needs a mom and a dad. Please don't change your law and marriage to say otherwise. Thank you for letting me speak today. Thank you for your testimony, Ms. Evans.